friend. Welcome or welcome back. I've got a power vinyasa class for you today that's going to target the muscles in the abs and also the muscles in the lower back. You don't need any equipment for this class, just a mat, and nor do you need any prior yoga experience in order to participate. We're going to go ahead and get started here in child's pose. So let's start in an all fours position. Shoulders stacked over the wrist, hips stacked over the knees. We're going to send the knees to the outer edges of the mat, connect the feet, take an inhale here. Exhale, send the hips back to the heels for child's pose. Forehead comes down to the mat, reach through the fingertips. Just taking a moment to arrive at our mats, connect with our breath. Realizing that we're no longer where we were before this. We're not where we're going to be after this. We're simply just here right now. Start to bring the awareness to any external noises, any thoughts that come to mind. Let's just acknowledge those noises and those thoughts with kindness and curiosity. And then bring the awareness into the breath. Breathing in and out through the nose. Noticing how the belly inflates on the inhale and how the belly collapses on the exhale. Inhale through the nose, fill the belly up all the way. Exhale, see if you can sink deeper into the heels. Squeeze all of that air out. Inhale again, fill the belly up all the way. Exhale, sink the butt into the heels a little bit deeper. Reach through those fingertips. Last time like this. Inhale, fill the belly. Exhale, let everything go. Sink a little deeper. Inhale, shift the weight forward, and let's come back onto all fours, and let's get our spine warmed up with some cat cows. So again, shoulders stacked over the wrist, hips stacked over the knees. We're going to take an inhale. We drop the belly. We lift the gaze for cow. We exhale. We press the mat away. We arch the back for cow. Inhale, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, round the back, drop the head for cat. Inhale again, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Use those shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, round the back, drop the head, squeeze everything into your midline. Last time, inhale, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, round the back, drop the head. Come into a neutral tabletop position. Press into all, press into all fingertips here. Tuck the toes under. Send the hips up and back. And let's come into our first downward dog. We're pressing firmly into our fingertips and base knuckles. Our shoulders are drawn away from the ears and down the back. Our hips are up nice and high. And we're trying to stretch our heels to the back side of the mat. You can take a minute here to pedal out your dog, alternating, lifting the heels up and down. Inhale, come high up on the toes. Exhale, send the heels down and back. Inhale again, high up on the toes. Exhale, sink the heels down and back. Inhale, send that right leg up and back, bend up the right knee, and start to open up the hip a little bit. You can do so just by moving the knee from side to side, do small circles with the knee, you can do large circles with the knee, just whatever you need to open and massage that right hip. Inhale, send that right leg back up high. Exhale, send the right foot all the way through the hands to the top of the mat. 
Send that left heel up off of the mat and then inhale, come into a crescent lunge. We're high up on the ball of the left foot. Our hips are squared to the front of the room. We're reaching through the fingertips out of the hips. Squeeze inner thighs together. A couple more breaths here. Shift the weight into the right foot. Step forward. Left foot meets the right. Bring the big toes to touch and come into chair pose. There's a direct line from the head down to the tailbone. Take the arch out of the back by tucking the pelvis. Reach out with the fingertips. Squeeze everything into the midline. Sit the booty back as low as you can. Couple more breaths here. Then we're going to transition. Start to pulse it out, send the booty back here for eight, keep the core engaged, seven, six, five, squeeze everything, four, three, two, and one, inhale, reach to the fingertips, exhale, send the hands back, squeeze into the shoulder blades, inhale again, reach to the fingertips, Exhale, send the arms back, squeeze to the shoulder blades, send those fingertips down toward the mat. Let's do this again for eight, seven, six, reach, five, four, keep breathing, three, two, one. Inhale, send the arms up, reach the fingertips. Exhale, forward fold over the leg. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold, hold the hand, step the right foot back, step the left foot back, drop the knees down to the mat, and let's take a modified vinyasa. Inhale, shift the weight forward. Exhale, squeeze the elbows by the sides, drop the chest, drop the chin. Inhale, slide through cobra. Exhale, forehead to mat. Let's do some more of those cobra lifts. Inhale, up for cobra. Squeeze the tops of the glutes. Exhale, forehead to mat. Three more. Three. Two. And one. Forehead comes to the mat. Inhale, press yourself all the way up to high plank. Exhale, send the hips up and back down with dog. Take a deep breath here. Inhale, fill the belly. Exhale, let everything go. Inhale, bring that left leg up and back. Bend at the left knee and do small circles, large circles. Move the knee from side to side. Just really open up that left hip here. Inhale, left leg comes up and back. Exhale, send that left foot through the hands. Pipe on the ball of the right foot. Inhale, come up, high lunge. Squeeze the inner thighs together, square off the hips. Reach through the fingertips, nice and strong here. Shift the weight into the left foot, step forward, big toes come to touch, chair pose. Couple breaths here. We pulse it out in three, two, one. Send the booties back. Squeeze everything into the midline for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, reach to the fingertips. Exhale, send the arms back. Squeeze to the shoulders. Inhale, up for eight, seven, six, really squeeze here, five, four, two, one. Inhale, reach the arms up overhead, reach to the fingertips, 
Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant the hand. Step the left foot back. Step the right foot back. Drop the knees. Inhale, shift the weight forward. Exhale, squeeze the elbows. Drop the chest, drop the chin. Inhale, slide up for cobra. Exhale, forehead down to the mat. And bring the arms out wide. Elbows are up. Pent it right next to you. We're going to do a modified or a we're going to do a baby cobra variation. So we inhale, press the tops of the feet into the mat. Squeeze the tops of the glutes. Exhale, forehead from, forehead comes to the mat. Inhale, up for five. Four. Three. Two. One, hold it here. Hover the legs above the mat, hover the arms here. We're gonna pulse it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, one, drop the head to the forehead to the mat, tuck the toes under, inhale, come into high plank, exhale, send the hips up and back. Deep inhale here, fill the belly. Open mouth, exhale, let everything go. Inhale, right leg comes up and back. Exhale, right knee to forehead. Pop up the back. Inhale, right leg up and back. Exhale, right knee to right elbow. Inhale, right leg up and back. Exhale, right knee to left elbow. Inhale, right leg comes up and back. Exhale, send that right foot forward through the hands. Inhale, come on up, crescent lunge. Square off the hips and let's place the hands on the hips here. We take an inhale here. We exhale and we dip, squeezing the thighs together. Inhale up, exhale dip. Inhale up for eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, open up, warrior two. Heel to arch alignment. Top heel is in line with the arch of the back foot. Hips are square as they can without moving the knee over the... Uh. <laughs> Hips are as square as they can, but make sure that the knee is in line with the second toe of the top foot. Squeeze into the shoulder blades. Look over the middle finger of the right hand. We straighten out the legs a little bit. Step that left foot in just about an inch. Inhale, reach forward. Exhale, tilt the weight down. Right hand comes to the ground. Left arm reaches up to the side. Triangle pose. Inhale, come back up, all the way to warrior two. Exhale, straighten out the legs, I'm gonna turn towards you. Straighten out the legs, turn the heels in, toes are pointed out slightly. We're gonna come into a goddess squat here, and then we're gonna do some lateral squats, side to side. Just like this. All right, let's keep it going here for 10. Nine, keep the back straight, eight. Seven, get lower. Six, five, four, three, deep breathing, two, and one. Come through center, stay in the goddess squat, hands come behind the head. We're gonna crunch to the right side here for eight. Using that left oblique, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, come back into warrior two. Exhale, reverse your warrior. Inhale, cartwheel the arms. Step the right foot back and let's take a vinyasa. Inhale, shift the weight forward. 
Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, hips up and back. Downward dog. Take a deep breath here. Fill the belly up all the way. Inhale, let everything go. Inhale, left leg comes up and back. Exhale, left knee to up, forehead. In the right place, Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left knee to left right elbow. Inhale, up. Always stay up all night. Exhale, left knee to right elbow. Watch the knee on left. Inhale, up. Exhale, left knee all the way through. Inhale, come up high lunge, high up on the ball of the right foot. Bring the hands to the hips, and we're gonna do dips. Take an inhale here, exhale dip. Inhale up, exhale dip. For eight, seven, squeeze, six, five, four, Three, two, one. Inhale up for high lunge. Exhale, open up warrior two. Go ahead and straighten out that left leg. Walk that right foot in just a little bit. Inhale, reach forward with the left hand. Exhale, left hand comes to the ground. Right arm reaches up, triangle pose. Don't dump into that right hip. Hip is high. Inhale, back to warrior two. Exhale, straighten out the legs. Same thing. Heels pointed in, toes pointed out. Coming into our goddess squat here. We shift the weight side to side. Getting as low as we can. Woo. First, 10. Nine. Eight, keep the back straight. Seven. Engage the core. Six. Five. Two. And one. Hold your squat here. Hands will come behind the head. We're crunching over to the left side for eight. Use that right oblique. Seven. Six. Five. Four. One, inhale back into warrior two. <laughs> Exhale, reverse your warrior. Inhale, cartwheel the arms over. Step the left foot back and take your vinyasa. Inhale, shift the weight forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale, fill the belly. Exhale, let everything go. Now let's shift the weight forward, come down onto our knees, and let's roll over into our backs to do some targeted ab workouts. All right, so lying flat on our backs, legs are directly out in front of us, straight, hands come behind the base of the neck. We're just gonna do some crunches here, keeping the legs flat on the floor, targets the lower abs. We inhale in our starting position. We exhale, crunch up, chin is slightly up. For 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bend both knees, bend those Key out the right arm and then send that left leg up. No, oh, sorry, key out the left arm. Send the left leg up. Right hand can either stay by the side or you can bring the right hand under the base of the neck. We're gonna do some crunches here. We're gonna crunch over. Right elbow comes to left leg. And then as we come back, we lower the left leg. Inhale here. Exhale, kick up the left leg and crunch. Here we go for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's switch sides. 
sides, the left leg bent, right leg comes straight up, key out that right arm, we inhale in our starting position, we exhale, we crunch the left elbow to the right leg, inhale, lower the left leg down, exhale, crunch. One last round of abs, and then take some off the So let's keep the legs extended, both hands come behind the base. We inhale in our starting position, we exhale, crunch it up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Leg up. We inhale here. We exhale. We keep the left leg up and touch. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Side, right leg kicks up, inhale here, cross it over for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And one, let everything go. Drop the legs directly out in front of you. Arms come up overhead. Let's bring that right knee into the chest. Massage the right hip by doing small circles with the right knee. Right knee comes through center, tee out the arm, take an inhale here. Exhale, cross the right knee over the left leg, look over the right shoulder. Inhale, right knee back to center. Exhale, send the right leg forward. Inhale, bring the left knee into the chest. Do small circles with the knee here. Send that left leg through center, tee out the arms, inhale here. Exhale, cross the left leg over the right, look over the left shoulder. Inhale, left leg comes through center. Exhale, send the left leg forward, bring both knees to the chest, give yourself one last hug. Want to come for Shavasana? Just stick with me here. Otherwise, you can end the video if you need to go ahead and go. We take a deep inhale here. We exhale, we unravel everything out onto the mat. Let the legs hang out wide, feet hang to the side, arms out wide by the sides, palms facing up. We start to bring the awareness back into the body back into the breath, back onto one word or one thought. We take a deep inhale here, we fill the belly up all the way. We exhale, let everything go.
Start to bring life back into the body by wiggling the fingertips, wiggling the toes, rolling the wrist around, rolling around the ankles, moving the head from side to side. And when you're ready, we roll over onto one side, keeping the eyes closed, slightly bringing the knees into the chest, and resting the head on the bottom bicep. We end our practice in fetal position, which is the pose that represents new beginnings and the pose that reminds us that from wherever we are, we can begin again. <laughs>